graduation from Maynard New Technology High School this spring of 2011, I, Hong Na Ting Nguyen, do hereby bequeath the following. My confidence and determination. Once upon a time, in a land far, far away. No. Wait, no, 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 not that far. Ah. No, what was I saying? Ah, oh, yes. Once upon a time, in a far, far away land, there lived a young girl. Me! You know, guys, there's nothing worse than an unconfident person. Nobody will take you seriously if you're not assertive, bold, and last but not least, confident. Duh. If I have learned anything throughout my high school career, it's that you don't need anybody's approval but your own. You are you, and trust me when I say that you don't have to change for anybody. I mean, just look at me. I'm sure there are plenty of people who wish I were more quiet, but you know what I say? Um, well, I can't tell you what I actually say, because that's just... I just can't, okay? But you know what? I have a reason to be confident. Here. This is a symptom. Yes, Hongna, you were definitely confident, but you have reason to be confident. It's because you've been successful, and success builds confidence. I mean, but you've met first go out there on the, the edge of the ledge and jump off, and, and you know, when you're successful at that, yeah, it builds up your confidence, and you're ready for the next challenge, and then you learn to complete that, that'll build confidence for the next, and so on and so forth. So, you've done a lot, and it's certainly built your confidence, and it's made you the awesome person you are today. Item 2. A strong sense of work ethic and collaboration. Something else I've learned over the course of my very, very, very long 12 years of education is that your education is muy importante. You might think that it's okay to blow off your work and do nothing. It isn't okay. First off, you're probably breaking your mother's heart because you keep failing all the time. Don't do that. Only me people do that. I know how easy and how very tempting it is to simply slack off and not do anything. Let your group members do all the work and you get to reap the benefits of a good grade. That's not okay. You know what that makes you? That makes you a big jerk. A lazy jerk. Do you want to be that? For one thing, you're stressing other people out because you're not contributing. I've had this happen to me more than enough times to know that it's not fun. If you're not going to learn and you're not going to work, why the heck are you here, right? Education is one of the factors that determines and shapes your, your future, the rest of your life. That's a very long time. You probably don't realize this, but to succeed in school and in life, you actually have to work for it. I know, not fun. Do it anyways. How are you going to learn if you're not going to put in the effort to do your work? Rhetorical question, you're not. Saying, sorry, I'm lazy is not a good excuse. Item 3. Creativity. To the incoming freshmen, let me give you a technical definition of Maynard New Tech. Maynard New Tech is not a traditional high school. Instead of the long-established lecture-based method of teaching, you experience a more hands-on, project-based learning approach with a focus on technology. It's a small school setting with an open environment and technology integrated into every classroom, and you're able to encounter the real world firsthand. The contents of your courses are incorporated into the projects. These projects often span anywhere between one to three weeks, if not longer. At the conclusion of the projects, you dress up in professional attire and present to a panel and your classmates. I've been at Maynard New Center for four years now, and let me just say, I've done a lot of projects. Teachers seem to like giving them to us for some reason. And one of the things that I found to be a very important over the past four years is that creativity is necessary in every class, whether it be English, PE, or even yeah, multimedia. Your, cre your creativity is a unique part of you that sets you apart from others, and it can be easily seen in the things that you create, like your videos, for instance. I have made my fair share of videos over the past few years. Laptops here and MacBooks there. We add new tech and a new atmosphere. More than just community service hours. More than an extracurricular activity. Key Club lets me stand out. 
Because I want to be an example for others. Because I have no limits. And each and every time I have to dig into my inner creative circle to find something that will help me make my videos unique and, of course, good. I mean, <laughs> I'm sitting in my bed right now, so how creative does my bed? Okay, it's not very creative. But that's how you know my creativity juices aren't running right now. My future is not set in stone, but I know that I've had a very successful high school career. And so long as I keep my head held up high, I know that I will conquer any obstacles that get in my way. It is with that thought in mind that I leave to you, my senior world. I wish the future generations of Community Technology High School students the best of luck and that you will succeed in each and every endeavor. Bye!